Hey, Mark Oldman coming at you from the Sunset Strip in Los Angeles, California. I'm about to execute something I call a PHBR. And what I mean by that is a pre-hotel bubbly run. That's something I do to fight the injustice, the pecuniary injustice of, of hotel minibar markups. Those drive me to distraction. I don't want to pay that much. So my idea is before getting to your hotel when you're on holiday is find any sort of simple bodega and buy some American sparkling wine for each day of your trip. So for example, check this out. We are here on the strip and we're driving by here and I see Look at that, right up there. It says liquor. Not only does it say liquor, it says consumer liquor. That's the sort of generic, serial killer attracting place where you could find real simple wine, the kind you want to kind of accompany you during your holiday. So I just parked and when we pick back up, you'll see me with my lovely American sparkling wine. All right, Mark Oldman here, parked on the Sunset Strip. Uh, freshly arrived at Consumers Liquor. What I want to know is, where's the liquor store for non-consumers? I love what they name these things. Anyway, in for my little bubbly, on my bubbly run right now. Shandon Brut. 21 bucks, drinking pleasure, about half the price of what champagne would be, and delivering about 80% of the value. So I'm going to take this back to my hotel and let the games begin. Hey, okay, so I'm on the final stage of the pre-hotel bubbly run. It's actually more like a hotel bubbly insertion now. I've got my $21 uh, Shandon American Sparkling Wine. I call American Sparkling Wine. Federal Fizz, by the way. Why? Just because it's fun. And here we are at the infamous hotel mini fridge. Uh-oh. You know how expensive this stuff? Now listen, I love real champagne, but this little split here, this little half is, by the way, I got so excited hitting this, I'm all worked up. $40 for half. And with tax, we're talking almost $90 for the equivalent of an entire bottle. $21 here for our lovely Chandon. So all you have to do with your mini fridge, actually let's just take this out, put this in here, plenty of room, commodious fridge. Put this in here, it's gonna chill up, and I happen to have a bottle open right here of the Chandon. What you should know about American sparkling wine is, because it comes usually from Napa or a very sun-ripened place like that, is the fruit's going to be a little richer than the European counterpart, than, than real champagne. And But the bubble will be great. No one will notice the difference. You can have it before dinner, you can have it after dinner, maybe in the jacuzzi with your loved one. And either way, you're going to be drinking bravely. Mark Ullman, coming at you from Los Angeles, California. Poo shit.